Hi, my name is Tori Thomas and today I'm going to be talking about the 20 common amino acids in biochemistry. I'm going to introduce the name, the three letter abbreviation, the one letter abbreviation, the side chain, and finally I'm going to talk about one fun fact for each amino acid. All right, first up we got glycine. The three letter abbreviation is GLY. The one letter abbreviation is G. For the side chain here, we just have a hydrogen, so it's actually an achiral molecule. And a fun fact is that glycine is found in the bladder, the brain, the intestines, the prostrate, and the skull. Okay, next we got alanine. The three letter abbreviation is ALA. The one letter abbreviation is A. For our side chain here, we have a methyl group. And a fun fact is that alanine is actually used as a flavoring agent. Okay, third is valine with a three letter abbreviation VAL, the one letter abbrevi abbreviation of V. And for our side chain here, it's a little bit bigger. We've got a carbon with two methyls and a hydrogen attached. And our fun fact about valine is that it is actually a precursor in the penicillin biosynthetic pathway. Next is leucine with the three letter abbreviation of LEU, the one letter abbreviation of L. For our side chain here, we've got a carbon-carbon with two methyl groups and a hydrogen on the end. And a fun fact is that leucine is actually used in hair conditioning products. Next, we got isoleucine with the three-letter abbreviation of ILE, the one-letter abbreviation of I. For our side chain here, just a little bit different. Now, carbon-carbon methyl on the top and on this first carbon here and a hydrogen. And a fun fact about isoleucine is that it is a metabolite that is found or produced by E. Coli. All right, for methionine, we've got a three letter abbreviation of MET, a one letter abbreviation of M. For our side chain here, we're mixing it up with a sulfur coming in. And then a fun fact is that methionine is found naturally in foods such as rice, wheat, milk, cheese and oranges. We got proline with the three letter abbreviation of PRO, the one letter P, and here is our side chain. We got a ring this time. And a fun fact about proline is that it is extremely important for proper function of tendons and All right, for phenylalanine, the three letter abbreviation is PHE, the one letter abbreviation is F. Our ring structure here is um, a little bit different for our side chain. And a fun fact is that phenylalanine is an essential aromatic amino acid that is the precursor of For melanin. tryptophan, the three letter abbreviation is TRP. The one letter abbreviation is W. Here we got two rings for our side group this time. And uh, tryptophan is useful in increasing serotonin. All right, we got serine with a three letter abbreviation of SER, the one letter S. For our side chain here, we are now up to hydroxyls. And a fun fact is that serine is used as a natural moisturizing agent in some For threonine, the three letter abbreviation is THR. The one letter is T. We got a little bit bulkier side chain here with this carbon, a methyl, and a hydroxyl up here. And a fun fact is that threonine is found in eggs, milk, and junk. For tyrosine, the three letter abbreviation is TYR. The one letter abbreviation is Y. For our chain here, we got an aromatic ring with a hydroxyl group coming off. And then for our fun fact is that tyrosine has actually been used as an antidepressant. However, there are mixed studies that suggest that this might not be as effective as originally thought. All right, let's move on to cysteine with the three letter abbreviation of CYS, the one letter of C. We've got a little bit different side chain going on here. And cysteine is actually used as a prevention of liver damage and kidney damage um, when there is an overdose of acetaminophen. Here we have asparagine with the three letter abbreviation ASN, the one letter abbreviation of N. We've got a different and new type of side chain here. And then for our fun fact is that asparagine is actually used as a nutritional supplement. Here we have glutamine with the three letter abbreviation of GLN, the one letter abbreviation Q. Added another carbon into this side chain here. And then our fun fact is that glutamine is actually used to reduce acute complications of sickle cell disease. Here we got lysine with a three letter abbreviation LYS, the one letter of K, with one of our longest chains yet that we got here. And a fun fact about lysine is that if you have a deficiency in it, you may actually suffer from bloodshot eyes, irritability, hair loss, and anemia. Here we have uh, arginine with the three letter abbreviation of ARG, the one letter abbreviation of R, with our quite long side chain we got going on here. And then a fun fact is that arginine is another flavoring agent. Here we have histidine with the three letter abbreviation of HIS, the one letter abbreviation of H. We got a fun little side chain here with a five membered ring. And a fun fact is that histidine is found abundantly in hemoglobin. Here we have aspartate with the three letter abbreviation ASP, the one letter abbreviation of D. For our side chain here, we have a carbon and this little group right here. 
And a fun fact is that aspartate is found in sugarcane and sugar. And to top us off, we got glutamate with a three letter abbreviation of GLU, the one letter abbreviation of E, add another carbon into our side chain here. And a fun fact is that it has a savory flavor although I would not recommend just trying this by itself. I just wanted to say thank you for watching my video. I hope you learned something new. And all of my fun facts were sourced from PubChem. Thanks.